president was on the road yesterday defending and promoting his executive actions on immigration. He sat down with Fusion's Jorge Ramos. Jorge Ramos has been sharply critical of this president for not acting sooner on immigration reform, giving him the label deporter-in-chief. Listen here when Jorge brings it up. The president gets prickly. The question is, are we doing the right thing, and have we consistently tried to move this country in a better direction? And those, like you sometimes, Jorge, who suggest that they're simple, quick answers to these problems. Well, I, never I said think that, no, though. yes you do, because that's how you present it. And I think when you when you when you Did present you it when you when you present it in that way, it does a disservice because it makes the assumption that the political process is one that can easily be moved around depending on the will of one person. And that's not how things work. Um, a tad defensive a there. A tad defensive. Yeah, and, you know, this is very much like all of the fights that Obama was having with uh, immigration activists up until this time. Uh, and, and there was uh, some bad blood between those folks and this president, and I think what we see there uh, is just indicative of some of that. Whether or not it's lingering, whether or not this executive order and possible immigration reform will wash all of that away, it's unclear. It was, in, it was interesting because a lot of those activists have since got on board with the president. Some of them traveled to Nashville with him yesterday as he made the case for executive action. Um, but Ramos, let's yeah. play devil's advocate there. Well, yes, he still, does. There's some lingering tension between. Of course. The and he was giving yeah. force to yeah, those people.